Hey everybody, it's Katie. I am 14 weeks today, which means by all counts, I am in the second trimester. I know this is just going to be the absolute best time, at least until the birth. Word is all out there now. We have told all of our friends, except for like a few off the grid types. And I've told all you guys now, so we're able to share in the excitement with everybody, and it's just been a lot of fun this week. I have felt definite fetal movement several days this week. I think the first time where I was like, okay, that is definitely, definitely it. I was 13 weeks and three days. I have also checked the heartbeat just a couple of times with my home Doppler this week and um, have had no problem finding a heartbeat. It's been in the like sort of high 150s. And pretty much all together, I feel awesome, except for when I don't. As a family, we had a really fun weekend last weekend. We just spent a lot of time with friends and a lot of time just in our yard, kind of hanging out and just, I don't know, we just had a really good time. That was especially good because this week has been pretty stressful work-wise. I have taken some extra work um, and I actually was going to work full-time all week, um, sort of trying that out uh, just, just for like one specific purpose. Um, my boss was going to have a big trial and he wanted me to help with. It ended up getting canceled and is going to be rescheduled. Um, so on the first day, I was sort of dismissed early. It's a mixed blessing because um, I would have gotten, for that week, I would have gotten paid uh, more for the week than I make in the whole month. Mike and I were able to go have lunch, just the two of us, which we haven't done since before Alice was born. And it was just, I don't know if that's the reason it was like such a great meal, but we both just had a really, really good time. Um, I also am doing some, I do like a second part-time job um, occasionally, which is scoring um, standardized tests, basically, like writing exams um, for different states, and I'm trying to do that now. Um, it's pretty hard to, to work my hours in. I've also just had some other, like, special projects at my regular job. I actually had to take Alice to work with me this morning. Um, I don't normally go in on Thursdays, but we had to go in for a couple of hours and just finish a project, and uh, let me tell you, take your toddler to work is not very fun. <laughs> um, at least this toddler, or at least in my office, whatever. Um, it, it was it was a challenge. But whatever challenges we've had this week have, you know, we've really sort of been uh, buoyed just by everybody's sort of the collective joy. You know, everybody's sort of sharing in our joy at this time. So it's overall been a good week. This week we did go tour the one birth center that's in our area. Um, talked to some of the midwives there and just kind of, you know, got a feel for the facilities. And then I also talked to a friend of a friend who has had a home birth, um, and I'm going to talk to like another friend of hers this coming weekend. So I'm just starting to like put my feelers out and do a little bit more research. I'm going to do a separate video about sort of all of our options for the setting of this birth and um, sort of the pros and cons of each so that as we make a decision, I don't know, I, I get to document it. And we're not really looking for any input because this is a, good, a decision we're going to make between ourselves, but... I guess just um, kind of like exploring, you know, what the options are and maybe be able to share some of the questions that we've had or, you know, some of the things to, to ask if you're in the same situation, whatever. Anyway, more to come on that. For symptoms, I have had some bad nausea. Um, a few mornings have been bad and a few evenings have been pretty bad. Although I feel terrible complaining about that because it's absolutely nothing compared to what some people deal with. Um, even just some of the moms in our community right now that are dealing with like real like hyperemesis um, stuff. This is, this does not even register. I've had a couple of headaches and actually a couple of um, just real mild cramps in my calves, which I feel like is pretty early for that, but otherwise nothing new symptom wise. I will do a belly shot in a minute since this is an even numbered week. The best thing about this past week, there were a lot of things to choose from, but I think what I'll say is that I found out that uh, uh, one of my first cousins and then another first cousin's wife are also due within a couple of weeks of me. And we live like at different ends of the country all over the place. So, you know, I don't see them very often, but I know at some point, you know, all of our families will all get together and it's going to be really cool that there will be three, I guess there'll be third cousins that um, will be super, super close in age. I also have a good friend who lives here in the same city that we do who um, I knew that they were trying to conceive their first child, but it wasn't something that we talked a whole lot about. We had them over last weekend just to hang out and we planned to share our news 
and um, we didn't even get a chance because they came out with their pregnancy announcement um, at the same time and they are due 10, no, 11 days after me. So I am gonna have a friend here to share sort of every step of the way with. Unfortunately, they are gonna move to New England like at the end of the summer, so we won't actually be together like all the way up until the end, but it's still really neat that I'll get to share that experience with her. That's not something I had at all. Um, when I was pregnant with Alice, I didn't have any close friends that were pregnant. Um, yeah, nobody in my family, nobody nearby, nobody just to share sort of the day-to-day -day with. So that'll be really cool. I just wanna thank you all for the awesome comments and messages and stuff from people on our announcement videos. You know how thrilled we are to be at this point, you know, and I'm just so happy um, that you're along for the ride with us. Okay, so this is 14 weeks exactly. I did just eat recently. I don't know if this is going to be the best view, but um, I feel like if this is, I don't know if this is just bloat, but if, if I have any indication yet of how I'm carrying, I think I'm carrying high again. I know you all let me know what you think. So, 14 weeks. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon.